Today I'm going to show you guys how to complete the mission called the setup in order to acquire the custom luchador rocket boat which you're going to need in order to complete the following mission called um, the heist begins and that is where you acquire the rare Eden Spark lightning gun. Uh, here on the map I'm showing you where this mission is located we have the keeper and we're going to go ahead and get started here this one is a bit lengthy so if you have not completed it before it took me about 45 minutes to get through it the first time Annika. Sheldon. I'll let and them Luke. talk through here <laughs> what is this Rodriguez see that over there apparently it's some sort of scientific facility right Texas that's the stingray an offshore research station, one of the three major facilities in what used to be the Eden Corporation network. For a dead company, they sure get around. They were doing research on the weather and electricity. Rumor has it they were trying to control lightning. <laughs> but around 20 years ago, something went haywire. They ended up creating a massive electrical storm instead. Swallowed them whole. And now, poof! turns back up after the last big storm. The one thing they did get right was something called the Eden Spark, a crazy science weapon that could shoot lightning. And you know who else took an interest? The Black Hand. So you're telling me the Black Hand now has a doomsday weapon next door to Medici. I'll be right back. Hey, hey, tough guy. No way you can just lone wolf this one. Also, they seem to be sitting on some serious shit. Portable Bavarium shields. And I want those. Luch here has kindly offered to build you a badass boat to take on the Black Hand. The way I see you do need something fast, maneuverable with some firepower. So here's my offer, Rodriguez. We break in, take down all the bad guys, you get your lightning toy, Luch and I split all the Bavarian loot. Deal? Just to be clear, you build me a badass boat, I save Medici, and for my trouble, I get a lightning gun. Deal me. Here, this plane will stop until you get on. So I'm going to rush to try to jump on it. Once you get on, okay. you start taking so off, we and heading? you're just going to stay magically stuck on first the roof first, there. Rodriguez. Stand a chance? You're going to need a bigger boat. Watch talking. Bigger is not so important. Faster, tougher, more firepower? Nah. Sounds interesting, Mooch. What do you need? neighborhood one-stop shop for quality intel and uh, other military sundries. Now I've heard tell about a super fast jet boat being built by our buddies the Black Hand. The agency's been eyeing it for a while. It's in transit on a cargo plane. You'll be waving at him soon, hombre. So Rico, do your thing. Hijack the plane, steal the boat, bring it to Luch. Talking. Attack boat without weapons is just boat. I need armaments, missiles, machine gun. Sheldon, you said you will get. How? I got this covered, my former commie friend. Uncle Sheldon has connections. Then get to it, Uncle Sheldon. Rico, you get the plane. Luch, just, uh, just sit tight. Luch, you two already met? You're gonna see this plane coming yeah, really quickly yeah, at you. Um, don't do what I did and try to jump on it right when it's passing. Uh, your plane's actually gonna turn around and catch up to it after it passes by. Otherwise, you're gonna miss it. If you jump off this plane here to try to zip line over there, you're gonna have to start over. Just hold your horses. what intel do you have on that plane? No, don't worry about it, amigo. 
There you go. Now you have the ability to zip line over there. Guys here shooting rifles at you. No big deal. I do have a bit of armor. Not too bad. So much for your run of the meal transport, Shell. What? How the hell? Rodriguez, hurry up and jettison the cargo. Open the back of the plane here. And then you're gonna have to use use your line here to uh, your tether lines to pull the cargo out of the back of the boat, out of the back of the plane. Once that falls out, you're gonna have to follow it, jump Guess out of the plane I'll miss and the rest dive of the down. Move. The crate's gonna break open and. Once it hits the water, and then you see it's the um, the rocket ship that you were trying to steal. It's pretty neat. I haven't seen anything like this so far in the game. I this have thing the ball. Is fast. You're going to love it. Guys are being busy. The target is currently on the mainland, traveling in a convoy. I sent a few of my guys there for support. No enemies yet here, the just driving the boat. And make sure no one right to a friendly dock so they can start modifying it. Tip with this boat when you're driving, it's a lot easier to uh, make turns if you're using the, uh, the gas pedal, the throttle. If you let it still in the water, it's real hard to turn. But if you've done that engine, it's, it turns on a dime. It's actually something you have to get used to. Special delivery for a Mr. Luch. My crew is already in place. We're just waiting for you. Now the next waypoint is almost five kilometers away. Now you can get the harbor you want. You can't fast travel. There is a light machine gun helicopter located right there at the dock. That's what I ended up taking. Uh, but down here to your left, there's also an airstrip with a couple airplanes inside there. If you want to drive one of those instead, that's fine, whatever works for you. All right, game on. Convoys en route to your location. Once you get to this point, Land explosives on that bridge and blow it on my mark. When they're trapped, we attack. When she tells you to put explosives on that bridge and blow on your mark, you have to get there immediately. Immediately, and put your uh, your remote explosives down on this bridge as quickly as you can. I put three. That worked. Two might work. Ready, Rico. I don't know. Just I went with three. It. Now. As soon as she says now, you have to blow that bridge. Otherwise, I'm gonna make you start this car all over again. Mine didn't go off for some reason right away. You heard the man. Move it! But we made it just in time. Now we just 
destroy all these guys. That was dumb. I guess it worked. Go ahead and take this vehicle mounted machine gun and wipe the rest of them out. Okay, that's all of them. Now, where are these stingrays? The guys actually did a pretty good job for me. How would I know? Look for a briefcase or something. There's gonna be a briefcase right here on the road. You should see it here somewhere. There it is. Briefcase. I swear that wasn't there Check. before when I ran past the first time. Good. Look, gotta go. I've got to steal a black hand boat for phase two. Sheldon will brief you on the rest. Some ammo point there to reload up on Sheldon your grenades here. and Get bullets. to this black hand dry dock. You'll find something you definitely want to steal from them. So, this dry dock is where they fit so-called electrical field generators to their boats. Next waypoint is almost... Look. You guys want to sneak in uh, stick just over four kilometers away. So I'd recommend taking an aircraft to get there again. Also, this one, very heavy. Accident slash storm debacle. Opposition to get there, a lot of firepower. Uh, so I would suggest doing something like I did here and take a the fighter bomber if you've unlocked that yet, or one of the heavily. Uh, one of the uh, helicopters with the heavy weapons. I'm sure you've unlocked one of those by now. This U7. Really fun to fly once you figure out you asked, how to fly. Henry. It's uh, a little bit difficult at first. And if you're going to try to use this road as a runway like I did, ah, so those generators probably try to block it off so cars can't come in here. So Sheldon, what are you getting out of this? The pride of making the world a better place, hombre. I'm just here to make sure that lightning gun thing doesn't fall into the wrong hands. <laughs> do you know me? Yes, I do know you. How about doing yeah, this for that Swedish one big pirate, pirate, that's for sure. Ooh, he almost got that motorcycle. What are you doing it for? We all have our reasons. One of the nice things in Just Cause 4 that we don't have here in Just Cause 3, you can actually change the orientation of the crates to land exactly how you want them to fall so things like this don't happen. Unfortunately, I have to try to turn this jet around on this narrow street. It's a bit difficult. Well, I got cars coming around on both sides. Higher than I thought. Okay. So here now, since I have the Rebel Drop plane plus uh, the Turbo Boost mod that I've unlocked, I'm able to get there a little bit faster now. It's been really quick in this thing. If you've flown this before, or if you haven't, you know that you have to get quite low in order to see the, the bombing grid. I'm at the right, and I've got go. To see where your bombs are going to fall exactly. So yep. let me see what they're going to light on the ground. Don't want to tip hand about our plans. First bombing run done. They've already hit me a few times there. Smoke coming out of the engine. You can't go very far away from this. Little island dock thing. Let's start over. Come back. Bomb 
on the one number two, they're shooting missiles at me. See the objects get destroyed left and right there. Unfortunately here, I went a little bit too low and I clipped something with my wing and died. I just wanted to leave that in there to show you. You have to be careful with how, just how low you go with this thing. Now, every time you die at this point, they will reset you on this speedboat just off to the side and you have to go flying back in and try again. Here it looks like I hardly did anything with that bomber jet. I think it's because I died. They always put back a few enemies to go to kill when you die. And now I'm going to give the wingsuit with the jetpack a go. There's unlimited uh, missiles and machine guns on this thing. I really can't beat it. But, again, this one is also a bit hard to maneuver, kind of like the jet. So I'm going to try to just hop up, up here and launch a few of my grenades. Maybe use the machine gun. Pretty high up, so it's a bit harder for the small arms to reach me. ants down there to take out from up here, so I know she noticed one of these Corvette heavy gunships, I want to take that over, it takes out these assault helicopters, butter, shot and kill with this thing. towers, light assault trucks, small gunboats, gone, one shot on this thing. I'm take this one over the first time. So I'm going to just go straight to this thing when we get here. I don't even bother with the bomber jet at all, unless you just want to fly it. I just want to fly it, it's funny anyway. Of course, there's still some small guys up on this dock that that big boat can't take out. If you've noticed earlier in the game, for some reason, All done here. can't always How do I bring this reach back? everyone up on decks above. One of my crew is on its way so with the chopper. Pop out and Figure out the rest. take out the last couple guys. Once you take out the last guy there, Perhaps you they will drop off to you a transport helicopter. Generator to the helicopter, which I did. Seems easy enough. 
problem is I had to learn out the hard way that one tether line was not strong enough to hold the generator and it fell off the helicopter right after I took off so this time I'm trying two tether lines and hopefully that will hold it. is all I have right now. I think a little bit later in the game or if you've done some other uh, missions that I haven't yet, I think there's an option to earn a few more tether lines in your inventory and that might make the difference here. back to our next waypoint here. One electrical field generator coming up. Not bad, Rodriguez. And what have you been up? Nothing really, just commandeered a black hand boat. Another boat. Something's already already dropping. The boat is too obvious. It's meant to attack to wreak lines. havoc. It's the Rico boat. Trojan horse boat. All part of the plan, Rodriguez. Boat stalking. Rocket boat almost finished. Need more time. So I'd really recommend waiting to hey, come to this thing. one until you have I you one of those voice modulators the, uh, black hand uh, until you've uh, unlocked uh, more than fun. two tether Our lines in your inventory. I think you can get up to four. already completely missing and this one looks like it's hanging on by a spider web. happens to you though I found out that somehow these generators float in the ocean that's convenient I guess so you can try doing what I did and find a, a boat nearby there's a few out here and tow it in to the land which I'm doing here with a jet ski which I regretted doing four minutes later because that took forever Probably find a bigger boat if you're going to do this. Now I'm going to drag this thing up on the land, request a rebel drop for another helicopter, and try again. Really increase my mission time in this happening. Sit there, the CS Comet. Did we have that one unlocked already? That's the one to use. The smaller ones, they might have a harder time going to sit underneath them. it again with my two tether lines and give it a second attempt here. I'm gonna be pissed if that thing drops off again. Okay, I guess three tether lines would 
three or four tether rounds would be the best option here. Unfortunately, I only have two right now. Find this thing as smooth as I can. When you get here to the drop point and you're maybe a little nervous like I am about dropping this chopper down too quickly, I found out once you get under 300 meters, they automatically accept the delivery. So you don't have to go down to the ground, just down to underneath 300 meters. You missed. Again. Your god missed. Ah, let me see here. Okay, try again. Good. Well done. So how does it look, Luch? Rue you got your high-speed jet engine, improved controls for better agility, and of course, missiles. All she needs now is cool name. It's a boat and it has rockets. How about rocket boat? What about, wait for it, the Luchador? Ah. So, let's head over to the Stingray, see what those black hands are. Great plan. If you want to die. What did she say? She said, drive safe. Hey, you know me. Sheldon, you want to chime in here? Well, this is what we know. There are five satellite stations surrounding the Stingray base, heavily guarded by the Black Hand. Not sure how that works exactly, but they act as safety systems for that big atmosphere modulator on top of the base. Unless we get the data from them, any unprotected objects... So what's the plan? Take the rocket boat and knock out those stations. Then the real work begins. You mean with the luchador? Not a problem. Hey, Luch, what's in that box? Yeah. <laughs> the luchador. Now this next part uh, of the storyline, you're supposed to go take this boat and go blow up all the enemies on the little islands surrounding the lightning weather storm area on the hey, Rodriguez. Uh, far Get those Eden data bottom models? left of your map. See, si. are we ready for the heist? Which, uh, I already did before I got to this mission. Time for phase two. Meet us back at the cove. We'll go over the plan and get things in motion. So it's already um, unlocking the next mission for me. But for you, you may or may not have done that already. You're going to have to go take this boat and go do that. Um, which now, I kind of wish I had had this boat when I did that because it was quite hard. This boat is really fun to play with. I recommend giving it a go. Alright guys, uh, thanks for watching. That is going to put us now into the next phase. Um, the mission, the heist begins where we acquire the Eden Spark Lightning Gun. I'm really excited to get my hands on this one. Been looking forward to it the whole game. Um, so, I'll see you then.